Was there ever a point in your life where you questioned your faith and leaned more towards atheism or that you question your life in general? Yeah, I think uh, everybody questions their life in general. As in like, <laughs> you don't want to be here anymore. Oh, yeah. So there was definitely a point in college where I was like, hmm, yeah, I'm not sure if it's, if, um, if it's better to live or if it's better to die. So yeah, there was a point, but that, that came because I didn't see the value of my own life and the value of what I could do on earth. And ultimately kind of what brought me back was, well, if God gave you this life, you might as well live it out to the fullest Mm -hmm. and see exactly what you can be. Right. And Jesus died not to show us what we can't be, but to show us what we could be. And so when I started getting back into the word, um, it was like sophomore year, went through just, you know, a tough period in my life where I was just kind of questioning things. You know, I wasn't playing ball as well as I had been in the past. Wasn't That was kind of the first time that I wasn't making like just straight A's or just getting like grades that I was used to. I was like kind of suffering on, you know, in school. And so I was just like, man, this sucks. And then you got to be at this for baseball, got to be at this for baseball. And so, it's you know, just, lot. yeah, just a lot that weighed on me. And I was just like, you know what? I didn't feel like anybody cared or that anybody was there, but there was somebody that was always there that was looking after me. And mm-hmm. that was God. And ultimately he was like, you're not being the best that you can be. Right. And that's why you're unhappy because you're not striving to optimize who you are. This isn't what I called you to be. Right. And I think a lot of people, when they go through, you know, challenges like that, where they are questioning, they want to be here. They don't, they don't see the value that they actually are or the value that they could be. Right. Because we all need to have something that we're looking forward to, to continue going forward. Right. Because if you're not looking forward, then you're either going backwards or you're just standing still. Mm -hmm. And that could be a recipe for disaster. All good points. 